What's up, YouTube? Welcome to my channel, Clown Wine 29, where you discover new wines and escape through the clouds. Uh, don't forget to comment, like, subscribe as I bring you a wine review. All right, so I'm going to do a quick wine review on a Cabernet Sauvignon from California. All right, so somebody was telling me about this uh, wine brand called, called Apothic Red, right? And I said, you know what? Let me just do a quick little review on it, see what I think about it. And uh, I went to the store and I came across the Apothic Cab, right? So I said, you know what? Let me go ahead and give it a try. So we're going to do a quick review on the Apoth Apothic Cab. Not the apothic red. All right. So this is a Cabernet Sauvignon from uh, California. It doesn't specify where exactly in California it comes from, but it's from California. This is supposed to be a, a Cabernet Sauvignon, full body as usual. That's what they're known for. Uh, high on tannins, um, acidity, uh, no sweetness at all. It's supposed to be a bold wine, right? So we're just going to give it a try. I already put, um, Corked it open. Should it open? I just need to serve myself a nice slow pour of this, of this apothic cap. Let's go ahead and do this. Alright. Leave the bottle right here so you can get to see the label real quick. Alright, automatically what I notice is the color. Alright. The color is not your typical. Um, I don't know if you can see. Your typical cab color. It's like, it's not giving, it's giving me a purplish, dark purple type of color, right? That's what I'm getting. I'm not getting that dark ruby red or dark red, you know what I'm saying? I'm getting, a, I don't know, almost like, I want to say they put a little coloring in there, but you know, who knows? Um, But it's different. Maybe they didn't, it, it depends on how they made the wine. They probably didn't. You know, aged in oak, uh, you know, oak sometimes uh, amplify the color of the, the red wine sometimes. So, you know, let's give it a sniff. Mm. I'm getting like, like, it's almost like, you know, like those, you ever had like chewing gum, um, but like the cherry flavor, that's what I'm getting. You know, like a fruity smell to it, which is cool. Give it a sip. All right, so I said blueberries. I said. Yeah, so I get little blueberries out of this. I don't feel any tannins out of it. Out, out of it, really, it has a undertone sweetness uh, in there. Oh, I wonder what that's about. Yeah, I said blueberry. Um, this is probably. All right, so if you don't drink you know, your regular bold, smooth wine, bold uh, reds, you probably will like this because it gives me uh, a lot of sweetness. It gives me no type of tannins at all. It has like uh, a fruity flavor, a fruity aroma. I get blueberries, like a little, like it's like, I want to say cherries, but it's not cherries at all. I can't even point it out. But um, there you have it, guys. Apothic Cab, Cabernet Sauvignon. Um, not too big of a fan. This is the 2019 Vintage. Uh, leave a comment below. Let me know if you ever had this cab. This is my first time having it. Uh, originally, I was supposed to try the Apothic Red because that's what everybody talks about. But... Um, I saw the cab. I said, you know what? I like Cabernet, so let, let me try the cab instead. But, you know, uh, I don't want to say I'm a disappointed, but this is definitely something different. Uh, if you had this before, leave a comment below. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And guys, as always, cheers.